Hello and welcome to another Primavera P6 lesson by Global Project Control. In this lesson, we want to talk about one of the common error in the SQLite database. If I do right click, go to the delete, I cannot delete this project because of this error. This error told me one other user opened the project, but this is the SQLite and it is a standalone. How is it possible? Let me to check my database type first. As you see over here, I'm using the SQLite. So it is not possible to other user login to my system. But if you want to be sure that you are the only user who work on this project and you open this project exclusively you should go to the file then press open over here if i select this project and i click on the user you will find that there is no other user there now i try to open it one other issue over here is as you see the database is a little bit slow than the normal we will talk about it how you can fix all of this for opening one project one small project as you see it take time more than usual and if I go to the activity, you will see that there is no much more activity available on this project. So the time consuming to open this project is not normal. But now I come back here. I try to PRJ-S-1. I try to open it again. If I click on the user, you will see that here is my user who can work on this project. But if I try to delete this one, I face it with this issue. The other user currently, other user currently have the project, sample project one open, you may not delete this project. This error happened on the database. You need to use the third party software in order to solve it. Now I close it. You should close the P6 first. Then call your third party software. I use DB browser for a school light and I want to connect it to my database. Here is my database. Be careful when you are working with this software, you shouldn't. It is better to correct myself. You have to follow only this instruction which i describe it to you other action you face it with more consequences because this is inside of the primavera p6 database please avoid any further modification now we need to modify two table over here the first one is project share if I go to the browse data and I go here looking for project share this one on this one you need to run simple school instruction if you want to run it you should execute 
one SQL description over here. It is delete from if you type it properly, you will see that delete from then name of table PROJ project share and execute it, run it. That's it. Now I want to change it to the use station. So I type U, then I should find usation over here. You need to execute another same instruction over here, but instead of project share, you need to change it to the use usation. Then name of table. This is the name of table. I already opened it over here and I need to run it like this. This is the result. And now I should come back to the main table over here. Write changes on my database. Close my database. That's it. Never open the Primavera P6 when you open your database with third party software like DB Browser for a school. Now I close it. Then I should run the database for Primavera P6 again. I not change anything over here because I want to look at the result on my current database admin now look at the performance of the software for sure it is better than the previous opening time and you face with the less trouble with the software and database works for you faster in comparison with the previous time now this is the project i close it and i open it look it works and it's open immediately this is the first change you can see the second one if i do right click and press the delete i'm able to delete this project immediately delete it delete this project for me and i will never face with that issue anymore because my database face with some error and now I fix it as you saw I'm able to open the project faster and delete the project which is not necessary to keep it thank you for watching global project control I hope this lesson was helpful to you please keep up to date on LinkedIn YouTube, Instagram, or Facebook for more lessons. You can also visit our website www.globalprojectcontrol.com to find all of our lessons and courses at once. Thank you for subscribing to the GPC YouTube channel.